What's up, Thenx athletes? It's Chris Heria, and welcome to another video of Official Thenx. Today, I'm gonna to stretch out your entire lower body from your quads, hamstrings, glutes, calves, hip flexors, adductors and adductors, and even your ligaments and tendons as well. And this is a routine that you can do every day, every morning, after your workout, or even on your rest days. Now, stretching is super important. and keeps your muscles flexible, strong, and healthy. It improves your mobility, your recovery, your performance while you're working out, and so much more, which will give you way more results in the long run. Now, there's two main types of stretching. That's gonna be dynamic, and static stretching. Dynamic stretches are not held for a long time and they're done before your workout. Dynamic stretching promotes healthy blood circulation and prepares your body for the workout to come, as well as decrease muscular tension. Now static stretches, which are the stretches we'll be doing today, are held for time and they're done after your workout. You don't want to do static stretches before your workout because if you're holding stretches, that's going to reduce the power in your muscles, just as if you were to overstretch a rubber band for a significant amount of time. When it comes back, it's not going to have the same elasticity, which is something that you want to have during your workout. But static stretching not only improves your range of motion but it also helps your muscles to recover faster allowing you to train the muscle again sooner which will lead you to faster and stronger muscle gains so with that said this static routine we're doing today is going to be great to do right after your workout or on a rest day so if you're ready to get started all you're going to need to do is make a little bit of space we're not going to be using any equipment at all so just relax get comfortable and get ready to follow along we're going to start off stretching our hamstrings and a bit of our calves let's put our feet together comfortably relax and just go down keeping your legs straight as low as you can go. We're gonna hang out right here for a good 20 seconds. Now, if you can't go that low, just relax your breathing, breathe in. And when you exhale, try to relax and go lower. Three, two, and one. All right, now let's cross our legs over. And now we're gonna emphasize on our calf and our hamstrings from the leg that's in the back. Just relax. Make sure you're breathing comfortably. Three, two, one. Let's switch. Cross over on the other side. Come back down. Inhale. And as you exhale, go lower. Three, two, and one. All right, let's come back up slowly. We're gonna put our legs open. Then we're gonna come right down the middle. Just relax. Keep our legs straight. If you can open up even wider, go for it. Five, four, three, two, and one. To one side. Remember, if you can go lower, breathe in and exhale. Go lower. Three, two, and one. Let's switch to the other side. Nice and slow, nice and comfortable. See, I have my opposing arm, I'm pushing down on my quad, so I can really get that stretch. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let's come right back down to the center. We're gonna bend our right knee first and lift our opposing leg up. And here, let's just hold this position. Make sure that your foot is flat on the ground. Three, two, and one. Now from this position, we're gonna roll. Roll, 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 roll our foot. So we're in this position now. Now if you can, bring your back up by straightening your body. Three, two, and one, let's come back down. We're gonna roll again. Now we're gonna switch sides. So we're gonna come up, foot down. This foot comes up now. Keep this foot flat on the ground. The flatter this foot is, the more you're stretching out your Achilles tendon, your calves.
three, two, and one. Now let's roll over, roll, back up. If you really push in, you're gonna feel the stretch in your glute and your hamstrings as well. Three, two, and one. All right, let's go ahead and sit down on the ground. We're gonna start off putting our heels together, holding this close. You can hold by your ankles and use your elbows to push down. Really opening up those hip flexors, hip adductors. Three, two, and one. All right, let's put one leg straight. Try to tuck this one in as much as possible. If you hold your ankle, that'll allow you to stay more forward. Just relax, breathe. Three, two, and one. Let's switch. Put the right leg out this time. So I'll hold this ankle, push down my elbow, and I'll hold this ankle so that I can get down lower. Three, two, and one. All right, let's put both feet in front this time. Now we're gonna collapse forward. Hold onto your ankles tight. That will allow you to stay forward. Now this is a great one to Regulate your breathing, breathe in through your nose. And on the exhale, go lower. Three, two, and one. All right, now let's emphasize on our glutes and across our leg. Bring your heel up and then push your face closer to your leg. Breathe and relax. Three, two, and one. Let's switch. This leg is not as flexible. It's more work. Three, Two, and one. All right, we're gonna take a different position now. So from a push-up position like this, we're gonna bring one leg, put it to the opposing side, bring your leg down, and then sit down right on it. You should really feel this on your glutes. Remember to breathe, and exhale, and go lower and more relaxed. Three, two, and one. Let's sit up. Just gonna hold this for like 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let's switch. Down. Relax, hold it for a good 20 seconds. Three, two, and one. Stretch it. Up. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, let's come right back to this position. We're gonna lean back. Three, two, and one. Let's come up slowly. Start to lean forward and lie on the ground. Then we're gonna stretch back.
five, four, three, two, and one. All right, next we're gonna go into the frog position. So you wanna put your knees out, legs out as well. Come down onto your elbows. And relax in this position. If you lean back, you're gonna feel more of the stretch. Regulate your breathing and relax. Three, two, and one. All right, slowly get out of this position. Whew. Sit on our butt real quick. Take one leg, put it behind just like this, and we're gonna try to lie down slowly. Down slow. This is one of my favorite stretches. Hold each side about 20 seconds. Three, two, and one. All right, come back up nice and slow. Bring that leg in. We're gonna switch sides. Bend it out. Come down nice and slow. up we are almost done here now from this position we're gonna cross over starting with our right leg put your elbow on the opposing side and really try to twist you should really feel it in your glutes and of course you're gonna be feeling it in your back as well but today we're emphasizing on our legs here we go three two one, all right, let's switch. Get the other one over and twist. Relax, breathe. As you inhale, exhale and really give it more twist. Get deeper in that stretch. Three, two, and one. All right, we are just about done. Let's stand up. We're gonna finish off with our quads and our calves. Make sure you're well balanced. You can use the side of a wall if you need to. Grab one leg, we're gonna hold. Three, two, one. Let's go ahead and switch. Really pull that foot back. You want to feel your quad really stretching. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we're down to the last stretch. We're going to finish off our calves right here. Now you can use a wall for assistance. You would bring one leg back with it with the heels flat on the ground and really push back into the heel. You're going to feel it all in your calf. Now, if you do have an elevated surface, one way that I find it works even better to get a better stretch is to put the ball of your foot on top of an elevated surface, heel on the ground, and really push in, getting closer and closer to the wall. Now, this I feel way more. But of course, if you don't have an elevated surface to step on, you could do it without an elevated surface, the first way I showed you. Five, four, three, two, and one, whoo, shake that off, do a little circle. Let's move to the other one. So you want that heel down on the ground and push it really close. You wanna make sure this leg is relaxed as you push closer. Three, two, and one. 
one. All right, look, that completes the static stretching routine for your entire lower body. If you're able to follow along and you got a great stretch, I'd appreciate it if you smash that like button. It really helps improve our algorithm and has YouTube recommend our videos to more people out there. So we really appreciate it. And to show our appreciation, if you comment down below right now, within 30 minutes of any upload, you always have a chance to win some Harry Apparel. Speaking of Harry Apparel, we're right about to drop our summer collection. The shorts that I'm wearing right now are actually part of the summer collection, dropping this month at chrisharry.com. But with that said, thanks so much for watching. And don't forget for more workouts, getting you in the best shape of your life, make sure to download the Thenix app in the App Store or Google Play Store. Get full access to all our workout programs, technique guides, and daily workouts that are gonna have you shredded. And join the millions of other Thenix athletes around the world getting in the best shape of their lives right now. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button with notifications on. We post every single Sunday, 8 p.m. USA Eastern Time. And for more of my content during the week, make sure you're following my vlog channel. That's youtube.com slash I post every single Thursday. And make sure you're following me on Instagram. With every post, I always do a giveaway there as well. So if you want a chance to be a part of it, then make sure you're following me on IG. And with that said, leave a comment down below and let me know what you want to see in the next video. And I'll see you Sunday, 8 p.m. USA Eastern Time. Mad love and peace out.